<sighs> good morning. I know by the time I see y'all, it'll be like good evening. So, good afternoon, everybody. Um, I'm just glad to be here this morning. I thank I thank God for my life, health, and strength today. If y'all glad to be here this morning, holler at me in the comment section and let me know. But um, anyways, y'all, this is a living room haul. I'm kind of mellow today because of the last couple of days I haven't been feeling well. But here I go today, back in effect. So I'm bringing y'all a living room haul. Y'all already seen the living room before tour. So I'm calling it the living room so y'all can understand what I'm saying. Because in real life, I call it the front room. Um, So the front room is the first item I got. Let me just get, get on with the haul um, so I can lay back down. Get all this stuff up my room. So, the first item I have is the Civil Bling. This is a curtain. This is one panel. And I got two of these. I need one silver and one gold. And the reason why I don't like this is because I have so much lint on my pants right now from this curtain. So, I'm thinking it's going to have fallout. It's not the actual glitter that's falling out. It's some kind of lint. But once I hang it up, it ain't going to be touched. So, I ain't going to let that bother me. But I got that. And I got a gold one as well. And let me show y'all. Some of the, a lot of the stuff that was in my living room, I already spray painted. So I spray painted this mirror right here gold. And it was silver on the inside already. On my wall, it was brown. And um, I spray painted it silver and gold. And I used the Krylon metallic spray paint. And that's what I use, Krylon. To paint that gold and silver. Trying to find somewhere to sit this stuff now, y'all. Listen, y'all. Y'all might need to go pop some popcorn or turn turn uh, music on or whatever. Or however y'all watch YouTube. Get y'all some candy. Because uh, this might be a little lengthy video. This is a tiger. Is this a tiger? A leopard. A cheetah. Um, leopard or cheetah print. Whatever you want to call it. But I already had this for years. My home has been... In Florida, my whole house was like leopard print, and this is one of the items that I had, and this is a just a container that I might spray paint because what I'm doing is I'm going to make my living room with more white and more silver and more gold in it. Y'all remember the color it was before with the brown and the reds and the, mo or the mobs or whatever? I'll give y'all a reminder. This is what color my living room had in it these pillows here so what i did was instead of getting rid of my pillows or buying new pillows i bought pillow covers from amazon this right here is one of the pillow covers that i bought this is actually a pillow case it zips open and you just put the pillow inside and the reason why i like this because I ain't have to buy no more pillows. And plus, if they get dirty, I can, like, hand wash them. You know, because you can't put these in the washing machine. Because, obviously, these are, like, sequins. And they're going to come off. So, they match the curtains I, that I got. They match these curtains that I got right here. This is a lighter color gold in the pillows. But, hey, it still go together in my head anyway. So, I got this. I got these lights. I've been had these lights for years and I ain't never know what to do with them and surprisingly the battery still work in them and I said I was going to put them in my front room and that's what I'm going to do so and I got this bath and body wrist counter hold I got from Walmart a long time ago this was already in the front room I just spray painted it silver and we're going to go with that I'm just showing y'all this stuff for I actually put it together in my front room because I don't know where I'm headed at I don't know what direction my brain taking me as far as decorating this is a little gold thing. I had this in the bathroom when I, on that hall when I had the before the bathroom tour. And this is one of those things that I had the toothbrushes in. But now I'm going to use it in the front room. Listen, y'all, my front room is going to be full of liquor bottles. Because my theory is, okay, my theory is uh, to keep a part of my husband in the room. That's what I tell him anyway. Shh. Um, to keep a part of my husband in the house because he doesn't have any say so of what I do as far as decorating. Because if he did, it, it, we gonna be sitting on buckets and, and you know 
because he's a man and he just don't have no taste in my in my opinion so anyways my husband has this big collection of liquor bottles and he had the collection of liquor bottles before he even met me and then every, he don't drink that much but when he do drink he makes sure he keep his bottle if he go to somebody's house and they got an empty bottle he get their bottle you just just to keep i don't know what was his fetish but either way i'm gonna keep the bottles but i'm gonna spray paint them and this is one of the bottles this is a huge gray goose bottle so if you got friends that drink liquor wine champagne and they got bottles get their bottles and blink them out they ain't gonna know just get their bottle don't tell them you're gonna blink them out just you ain't even gotta blink them out you can just simply spray paint them and bring them to life um this here is a big this says 1.75 liters that's how big it is and right now oh it's what's in it is um he had this so long when you open it when i open up it still smelled like liquor because it was like a little corner of it in there and i pulled it out i put water in it and i put bleach in it and i'm just gonna let it sit till tomorrow or whenever i'm ready to start you know working with it i got that bottle i got the ciroc bottle he just got different variations of bottles and all of them got bleach water in them right now so that's what you working with and I already spray painted this one. This one was a, I don't know. Oh, it says Belvedere. This one was a Belvedere bottle. Now he had these bottles for years, way stored in the back, in the back of the house. And he was just saving them. He saved his bottles. He put, he cleaned them out and he put pebbles in them. But we got so many pebbles in the kitchen, we don't need no more. He used to sell, give them away to people and stuff like that, but he stopped doing it as much. But um, this is, this is a bottle of exclusive. This one has bleach water in it, getting ready to clean, getting ready to be cleaned. All I do is let the bleach water sit in there with a little bit of detergent. I let it sit in there so it can get the bleach smell in it. Because if I open them and want to put like some decorations inside it, like some twigs or whatever, um... It won't smell like liquor. I rather for it to smell like bleach. This says absolute. This is an absolute bottle. I put some. I went outside and on the tree. <laughs> yes, I literally went outside on the tree, broke some branches off, and spray painted them gold. I was just testing it to see what it was gonna look like. And um, these real blinky gold ones I had um from the Dollar Tree, so I would just put them in there to see what they was gonna look like. And that's what I got so far, but I'm not finished yet because I'm just, I was just playing with it, you know. And I got two of those, two of those, the same bottles, same bottles. This is what that bling looked like from the Dollar Tree by itself. It looked like this, this gold bling. So I got that. Okay, y'all. Yeah, I remember this. I spray painted this already. This was just like a, um... This is a thing. I done had this for years. And my cats were sitting on top of it, actually. Um, my cats that I have. I spray painted them, too. But they didn't come out right. They didn't come out as white as I want them. So, I'm going to go back over them with a little white. I got a little white tube of um, spray paint. And, usually, these were sitting on top of these. Man, I done had these for so, so many years. So many years. And when I originally purchased these cats, I got them from a yard sale. It was a set of three. And uh, they were white, white when I got them. They were snow white, like the color of my shirt. And I didn't have any white in my house. And I spray painted them brown. And I spray painted the back dark brown. I spray painted this like brown color. I showed y'all in the last video what color it was, but... I want them back white again. You can see like on the hood it was like a brownish color. I want them back white again. So that was so many years ago. I probably didn't even have Scooby in it. He's 15. So this is a scarf. A scarf. A scarf. A scarf. A scarf. Yeah. Whew. Yeah. So this is a scarf. This is actually a head scarf. I actually had this on in the video when I went to the hospital. So, I might incorporate it into the front room or something. I don't know. I was just having dreams. But then again, I like it around my neck and I like it around on my head. So, it might just stay there. Um, this is a big solid ball of something. I don't know. It's just a ceramic ball. I'm going to spray paint this and clean it off. 
I found this at Ross. I actually have another one hanging in my front room because we don't have a light in the front room. So I've, I was trying to see if I can get some kind of lighting in there. But this is what I found. I found this at Ross. And one of the things, like a couple of the things was missing. So they gave me half off of... It was $12.99 half off. So they, I think I got it for like six bucks. And they got all of these things on there. It was like two or three of them was missing. So... I complained and I got it for a discount. I already knew that's what was gonna happen because that's how I roll. Everything I buy be at a discount, <laughs> usually. Okay, now this I spray painted. Y'all can see the back is black. I didn't worry about spray painting the black, the back. Um, it was a brown color, but I spray painted it gold using Krylon metallic spray paint. Metallic gold spray paint. And now this is how that turned out. I have two of these. So Y'all seen this in my last video. I have this. I'm going to put on some of those bottles. And, oh my God, this is the big cat right here. This is the big cat. It's a three-piece. And see how I spray painted it white? It's not white enough. It's, it kind of looks like a grayish color. And I got these bottles here. I got these bottles. I already spray painted one gold and one silver. This is a rock bottle and this is another Belvedere Amsterdam or something. But uh I got that. Y'all, I'm telling y'all, if y'all know somebody who collect bottles, I uh a lot of black people do who drink, cause I know my sister do too, because she always think the bottles cute and she just leave them in her house or whatever when she get through drinking, but um they make good, they make really good vases. And I went to the Dollar Tree and got some of this. Did y'all see the bling on this silver one? This, these silver bottles right here. These are the ones I got in my bathroom. Not sure how well you can see the bling because when I did my bathroom video, the bling didn't pay off that good on camera. And, uh, see that? Let me see if I just, I can't get it, but y'all get the picture. Then, then they had gold ones, then they had white ones. So my front one gonna be a mixture of silver, gold, white, black, brown, beige, tan, girl. I ain't got it together yet. I ain't got it together. But so far that's what I got. And I have these. Do y'all remember the African ladies? Ooh, do y'all remember the African girls I had in my front room? I had got found these feathers and I said I was gonna break down the African folk. Hold on, let me go get y'all the African girl just in case y'all ain't seen them. Okay, y'all, these is the Africans. Now, I'm not gonna destroy this picture to whom it may concern. I'm not gonna destroy this picture because this is a very nice picture. It came in a very nice frame and I'm just tired of looking at it, you know. Maybe years down the line I wanna see them again so I can use this picture again. It's very nice. It's good and sturdy, but I'm tired of looking at it. So, what I plan on doing is um, getting this picture, flipping it over, putting a foam board in front of it just so I can DIY on the foam board. And this feather right here, I don't know yet now. Ain't nothing written in stone. And just making it plain and simple, just like this. Is that too plain? Is that What is that, y'all? Y'all... I don't know. I was just thinking of something. Um, Y'all hit me up with some ideas I can do with this. I was thinking about painting different colors of paint and making it like an abstract design. But I don't know. I didn't want it to be too busy. But then again, the whole front room already busy. It got 50 limb different colors. And uh, I really don't feel good on this video. But I'm pushing through, y'all. Um, and I got these balls that I... It's going to be a DIY. I'm going to just show y'all the ball right now. DIY coming soon for this ball. I needed a tray. And I couldn't find a tray. So, I got this picture frame here. That was on the wall. Picture frame? Mirror that was on the wall. It hangs on the wall. And, um, I'm going to lay it down on the table. And use it as a tray. Okay. 
That's what I'm going to do with that. It's the same exact frame as the other one that I spray painted. Um, this right here is a piece of fabric that I had. It's just a random piece of fabric. And I'm going to use that as part of the curtain. My brain, that's what my brain say. Oh, this right here is an old flower that I had in my house for so many years. I don't had this thing that been with me for so long. It's just a piece of the flower. What you call this? Leaves. And I'm going to put that somewhere in now. And then I got some more flowers from the Dollar Tree. So the only thing I actually bought that I didn't have before was the flowers from the Dollar Tree. And those curtains, I had got them from Amazon a long time ago. The the, the sequin curtains. I got those from Amazon a long time ago because I was going to use them for one of my backdrops in, in uh, one of my YouTube videos. But I, I ended up not doing that because it's just too much to make a whole setup every time. So, anyways, I got this from this from the Dollar Tree. And this was half off. It was $4. So, this is a throw. That's all this is. But it came in this pretty flip up box. I got it half off because it was supposed to be a pair of socks in there. And there wasn't any socks. It said a throw and matching socks. So, I figured... Since it was this color and I was going to make my leopards white and I was going to fill in these spots with black, this will match. And then also, I can use this sturdy box somewhere in there, I guess. I don't know. And um, I think that's about it, y'all. All this other stuff y'all seen, these Luna 4 balls coming soon. And this is my other leopard. Hopefully, I can make this leopard match this this some kind of way and then that'll be like one of the colors in my living room and i got these balls from the dollar tree i mean balls these cups okay y'all so and you're gonna need some luna foil i'm gonna do a diy i'm i feel kind of sleepy right now y'all y'all um just pray for me today i'm not having a i don't want to claim that i'm not having a good day but i'm not feeling so well but uh, I'm going to keep y'all posted on what I do to the living room. So stay tuned to my videos. And that's all I got to say in this video, y'all. Thanks for watching. And I will holler at y'all later. Bye.